Okay, my thoughts on Disney buying out Fox. I'm one of the few people that thinks this is a horrible thing. Okay, Marvel gets the rights back to their characters. That I don't have a problem with. But it's virtually impossible to compete with Disney now. Look at all Fox owns. I mean... Disney can just throw money, a pile of money after pile of money at their movies to make it better. And now they're going to be get all this more revenue, which is going to make it harder for smaller film studios to compete. I feel like they already, I think it's ABC or CBS they own. I get those two confused. Now they own the Fox News affiliates and stuff. They're getting a monopoly going. Can't no one compete with them? This is not a good thing. They even own Alien and Predator now. Two franchises I love. And after seeing what they did to Star Wars, I'm never seeing another Alien and Predator movie again because Disney's going to ruin that too. But it don't matter because they can just throw pile after pile of money on it, turn it into a cash grab, and make their money back. Creativity is a dying art, and this hurts creativity even more. Up-and-coming film studios, don't even bother. You can't compete. They'll put you under. Disney has become too big and too powerful. And... Like I said, this is just going to hurt motion pictures in the long run. You're going to see less creativity and more throwing money at it. Look at Star Wars. They own Star Wars. That's a license to print money. It doesn't have to be good. The movie could just be one of the characters sitting in a chair for three hours. And because it's Star Wars, it will make more than its profit back. It doesn't have to be creative. It doesn't have to be inventive. It doesn't have to be original. Yeah, this is a rant, but I said, I think this is just a bad thing in the long run. Disney already owns too much owned too much before this and had, was too powerful of an entity before this. Now, forget it. And for those of you, well, I'm not going into the political side with the news stations, but just, it's a monopoly that needs to be shut down. It's going to make it harder for smaller film studios to compete. And even other bigger studios can't touch them now. Well, they couldn't touch them before, but forget it. A Disney animated movie is guaranteed to dominate the box office. A Pixar movie is guaranteed to dominate the box office. A Marvel movie is guaranteed to dominate the box office. A Star Wars movie is guaranteed to dominate the box office. Um, They got Alien and Predator now. That's going to do extremely well. Oh, they also have the rights to Avatar, which is guaranteed to dominate the box office. Disney owns the box office now. And, like, look at what they're doing with Star Wars The Last Jedi. They're demanding a larger percentage of profits from the tickets than is the industry norm. And they're also demanding that if you want to get The Last Jedi in your theater, it has to be on your biggest screen for X amount of days. All fine and well, but what if you're a small theater with, like, maybe one or two screens? If you have to keep it on for, like, two, three weeks with one screen, that's the only movie you're going to be able to show. What if you're a smaller theater with two screens? And that's just it. This is even smaller theaters and stuff this hurts. Even bigger theaters. When your movie ticket prices go up, here's why. Disney demanded too much money from ticket sales for The Last Jedi. And now that they have all these other franchises, they're in the driver's seat. They're going to make movie prices go up more and more and more. Now that they seem they can get away with the ticket prices from The Last Jedi, they're going to start doing it with all their movies, which is going to make the theaters raise their prices in us, the viewers, are going to have to suffer paying more out of our own pocket. So, 
20th Century Fox executives, shame on you for helping ruin the movie industry and putting money in your pocket. George Lucas, I know you regret selling Star Wars, but too late. You're responsible for this too. No, this hasn't been a normal movie review, but I'm just annoyed about this deal. You can tell I think it's going to be a bad thing. Like and subscribe you want, even dislike. Comment and tell me how I'm wrong, that's cool.